Hey guys, I'm LB, and I think I have figured it out. I haven't actually tested it, though I just kind of started it, and then I decided I was gonna start recording. So, put a guy here, put a guy there, swap over to that guy. Actually, no, we want to be at, uh, this one. Actually, I don't really think it matters that all that much. So if we keep walking them over here... Oh no, it does matter. So we need to be this one... Oop, uh, come on, place the guy, please. Swap back. Walk over. There we go. So now, we can get... ...like that. And we're done! Ta-da! That was actually You should have been able better. to detach the last panel by now. I hope we were right to trust those survival instincts. She is like weirdly passive aggressive. I don't really remember why. But yeah, that that puzzle, I like that puzzle. It was actually harder, but the, the solution's pretty simple once you get the hang of it. So looks like we just need to get to the teleporter and then get out of here. I still don't know why this area is like this, I guess... I don't know. Okay, so, let's head to the 48. <laughs> it's upside down, that's right. Okay, more puzzles this way, I assume? Yeah, okay. The one called the Swapper, it manipulates minds by some method that is not persuasion or argument. Is it a weapon? <laughs> Interesting. It's likely the Watchers aren't even aware they killed the crew, just as you're unaware when your immune system kills a virus. Once our fate was clear, Chalmers and I took steps to protect ourselves. No, the only way to survive is to land the station, to return them home. Okay then. Let's go to this one. Okay. <laughs> uh, what is... Hang on. What's, what's this? Nothing? Oh, duh. Let's reset this. Actually, we want to do... I think that... first. Oh, well, not like, that closely. That first, and then that. Ah! <laughs> so close! That first... Then... that... oops, come on. And that. Yeah, that was an easy one. Okay, let's go up to the next one. Wow, so much red. Interesting. What is this box for? Ah, 
Ah, I know what's going on here. Let me... let me reset this guy. too hard. Not sure why the puzzles change in difficulty so drastically all the time. That was close. I forgot that the game doesn't pause when the map's open. I almost killed myself. Okay, two buttons. Four buttons, actually. And we only have four clones. So I have to stand on one of these buttons at some point. Oh, I think I- I think I have an idea of what to do. Oh, that was a bad idea. <laughs> Let me try this one more time. There we go. Now... we do... this... Oops. Nope, not yet. That... And... that. Yeah, that was simple. Oops, come on. There's something here now? Oh, I missed the memory terminal, okay. In under 32 hours, more than three quarters of us have succumbed. 124 crew members and less than 30 remain. We're holed up in this derelict module, headed for command once we're rested. People say it's the most protected part of the station, but then people are scared. They're saying they can hear the Watcher's thoughts. That when you do, you get sick. I'm trying not to listen to them. Okay, let's take the teleporter. Let's see... where did we want to go? Ah, right, up- up there. Looking at the edge of my screen for anything else- nope, okay. Yeah, okay. Okay, so now we're here, right? Yeah. We have 124 orbs and we only need 93. Okay, we should be clear to land. We're waiting for you at command. 
We may get off this station yet, though in how many pieces? At least this way we have a chance. That doesn't look like it launched properly. Okay, let's step over here now. There are 23 of us left alive, most of whom are sick. Command has been locked down from the inside. The Watchers are what's killing us. We know that now, but even if we had days ago, we wouldn't have been able to jettison half of them off. Yeah. We know that now, but even if we had days ago, we wouldn't have been able to jettison half of them before there'd be too few of us left alive to do it. We brought on board so many. We're a long way from anything out here. I wonder how long it will be before we're discovered. If anyone finds this for your own sakes, don't talk to the Watchers. Oh, that turned off the gravity, huh? Oh my goodness, there's dead bodies in here! There's dead bodies in here! That's not You're good, right? I suppose how a person could survive here so long. I've had time to wonder that myself. My conclusions are non-cognitivist in character. The terms person and survivor too ambiguous for reasonable discussion. It's too late now. At one time there were many mines, now there are not. They disconnected from the chain, as you will too. Okay, so there's a teleporter here, which is good. This is... console. Okay. Stop! We don't have time for this. There's something I have to show you. Load up the specimen holding log. Where are you? Who said that? Both good questions. I can only answer the former with certainty. It took us years to... We are currently inhabiting these brains. We are these brains. Do excuse Tenet. Some people don't realize identity theory is more out of date now than when we sealed ourselves in here. We had a choice, Dennett. Die out there, starve in here. We'll use the swapper device to inhabit these research specimens and await rescue. I'm not proud, but which would you choose? In retrospect, certainly not the option we took. I know what you think. I was asking her. I'd have to believe you first. The evidence is right there. Take a look. Wait. What you're telling me isn't possible. Tell me who just materialized in front of my eyes. Tell me who I just ejected into space. You ejected your clone. Perhaps your clone ejected you. Does it really matter? You're still yourself. Copies of copies of copies. What's important now is that we get off this station. The ship I came here in is fried. I have a rescue team on the way. They'll be here in a day's time. Not soon enough. Why not? There's a life bomb on this station that will kill us in a matter of hours. And you just unsealed the only shielded section. We were safe in here for decades. There must be something we can do. There might be, but not like this. You'll have to use the device to release me. Swap places with me just until I can put things right. It's not as simple as that. You can't make me do that. I won't do it. Even if I were in a position to make you do it, I wouldn't. You have the same choice we did. You can die here, or you can do what you have to to go on.
well then. Now the story should start making more sense to those of you who have not seen the story to this game before. Swapper device engaged on all three mines simultaneously. Result, me. When the device was engaged by the trespasser, her own mine was combined with the Chalmers and Dimmit mines to create me. I cannot tell if I am all of them or none of them, for I do not remember what it is like to be any other than I. Okay then. Let's see, oops. First you swap us into brain specimens for a century, then you talk this girl into using the device. Now look at us. We are three different people locked into one body by your damn swapper. Does crazy even apply here? My mind was my own when I came here. You two can think what you like. I am going to land the station. You're going to kill us all. Good. We should have done it my way. Incredible. After all these years, you still cling to these dogmatic intuitions about the soul. The device doesn't work like that. You wanted to swap with the head watcher and take control. It would have destroyed you. I don't believe you can adequately explain how you know that, so I defer to the simplest explanation. Not a soul, necessarily, but something which remains, even if the physical facts change. After all, we've been through countless bodies, but I still feel myself. If I'm right, then how would you ever know? I want to know. Please, let's keep things civil now. You've taken everything. You've given me no choice. Please don't. There's only one way to be sure. Well, that just happened. Ah, this is where we were earlier. Right. Yeah, we were down there earlier. So yeah, there were three mines in her. I, I forgot about that. I knew there were three mines to begin with. I thought that... I remembered incorrectly, I guess. Oh, okay. It always were he picking using fr fr fr. This one's still learning to talk, I guess. Hurt, 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 hurt. Something is wrong with who I am. I can't see that dimension. Right? Because they just swapped into the rock and messed everything up. There's no point apologizing, it's too late for you now. You are sick, you will die. Unless... Transmission detected. 
broadcast location, unknown vessel. This is Rescue Java 509 Alpha responding to SOS request. Do you read, over? Uh, to anyone on board, we're seeing some troubling readings here. Whatever you're exposed to, you're going to have to get off that station before we arrive, or we're going to be bringing home bodies, over. We'll be with you in approximately 13 hours, Theseus. That's one, three, out. Out. <laughs> The natural resources placed within our reach are all but exhausted. Research Station Thesis is one of seven remote outposts established at great expense in a time of great need. Its remit is the long-term identification and synthesis of useful alien as materials. I was going to say asteroids, but it's materials. We ask our crews to survive on the frontier beyond the comfort of your families at home, beyond any hope of relief or rescue, for decades at a time, and we ask you to take the labor of that toil and turn it over to us, for the good of the many, and for the good of the families who will not forget you. You will be stationed seven years travel from the nearest outpost. You will be expected to function largely self-sufficiently and, in the absence of reliable communications, to maintain professionalism and isolation, for extended periods of time. An endeavor of this scale has never been attempted before, and you will find extensive documentation stored securely on the root directory. Research station thesis is under the Project Sisyphus operational umbrella. Interesting. I thought that was the end. sure what I'm doing here. We're so close to the end of the game, though, that I think I am not going to end off the episode here, because... Yeah, we're 24 minutes in, but I'm pretty sure this is the end of the game. Ah, oh, duh. Duh, duh, duh. That was stupid of me. I 
patch? Long distance so What? I think that's a bug. It's showing me stuff on the map that is not supposed to be available to me right now. Wait a minute, is that... is that her? kind of forgot about that part. <laughs> it's been that long since I've seen this game, but yeah, this is a cool game. I really like the premise of the, the swapper. The puzzle mechanic's pretty clever. It's not, not really a unique thing, because I'm pretty sure there's been other games that have used that mechanic for puzzles before, but I really liked how it was done in this game with the story and the, the ethics of it all, and talking about the mind and what it means to be who you are. Personally, you know, I'm- I'm agnostic, so I- I personally just believe that we're just big sacks of chemicals and that we're organic computers, basically. But, it is still something that we don't really fully understand how the brain works. So you can really just believe whatever you want. Science hasn't figured it all out yet. This is a cool game. And I'm glad that I found out about it through Good because... It was his playthrough that encouraged me to buy this game and try it out myself. So yeah, if you- if you liked this game, then definitely check it out, it's on Steam, so... yeah. Really cool game. As always, if you liked this episode, leave a like, or if you hate the sound of my voice, leave a dislike, it's up to you. And, uh... I don't know what I'm gonna be playing next. I- I know I said that I'd be playing the Talos Principle next, and that was obviously... wrong, because I played this next. But, uh, yeah. I- I might play the Talos Principle next, I don't know. I'll- I'll have to figure it out, because I still haven't- I still haven't installed it yet. I haven't even tried it yet. I don't know if it'll run. I'm kinda nervous about it. But, uh, as for this game... Really cool. As I said, check it out. And I will see you in the next episode. <laughs>